Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Who doesn't love some good old fashioned chicken and waffles? And that's what we're making today at the Sister Circle Kitchen. But this recipe has a little twist. Please welcome Kelly Farrell, owner of Nana's Chicken and Waffles. How are you? I'm good, Trina. How are you? <laughs> Thank you for having me. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Okay, so tell me about what we're going to do today. So we are going to do one of Nana's signature waffles. Mm -hmm. We're going to do a banana pudding waffle. Ooh. Yes. See the calories, moment on the lips, lifetime on the hips. Tell yes, us, tell us what yes, we're doing. Yes, 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 yes. So we're going to go ahead and build a waffle, okay? Mm -hmm. So this is my grandmother's signature recipe. Okay. Okay, like we do banana pudding. So you know, it's your grandmother's recipe for, from banana pudding, or she actually made the banana waffle? From banana pudding, and then really? I infused it with a waffle. Mmm. Yes. So show me what we're going to do. All right. So I'm not going to steal it and take it to my restaurant, I promise. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. <laughs> but if you do, but if you do, it's okay. I'd get, I would say Nana's, inspired by Nana's. Nana's inspired okay. by Nana's. <laughs> I can do that. All right, so we're going to do two cups. Two cups. Of all-purpose flour. All-purpose flour. Yes. Now, we don't want to use self-rising, and tell me why not. No, it's it's going to make, it, it's not going to make our waffle fluffy like the okay. way that we want it to. We're going to do two tablespoons of granulated sugar. Two tablespoons of granulated yes. sugar. Now, what if someone is having a um, tablespoon of corn Someone starch. doesn't like you know, glucose or doesn't like flour, can they use something different, like a spelt flour maybe for like always. vegans or vegetarians? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. It's going to give it the same flavor. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and do our, our wet ingredients. We're going to do um, two cups of buttermilk. Two cups of buttermilk. Well, half, a cup and a half of buttermilk. Okay. Yeah. All right. We're going to do uh, two tablespoons of melted butter. Melted butter. Mm -hmm. Now, you said that you got this recipe from your grandmother, and you have five girls. I do. Yes, yeah, so have, have you five taught them the recipes girls. as well? They do. They love to cook. We do mommy and me cooking all the time. Let mm -hmm. me tell you, I have a whole house full full of girls. Mm -hmm. Lots of girls. Even the dog is a girl. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so we do. We enjoy our mommy and me cooking times. All the time. Yep. Go ahead and do your two, um, your two, two eggs. And you've yes. been in business now for two years. I have. In Conyers. I have in Conyers, Georgia. Yeah. So tell me about your concept. What inspired you to even open up a restaurant? A vision board. Okay. Yes, a vision board. Aware My husband that. and I. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes, yes. Um, go ahead and just put it just, just a little bit, just a little bit, just a little bit. We'll go ahead and start mixing. Okay. So we know that you are going to be at the 2019 Super Bowl. Yes. How excited are we? Yeah, it's up. We're not going to touch hands while we're cooking. Super excited. <laughs> Go ahead and start. So I'm gonna start is this going this to you. be your specialty, or do you have any other specialty oh, waffles? Oh, we feature over create? 10 different waffles at the restaurant. We have mm -hmm. um, French toast, lemon, of course, the um, banana pudding, mm -hmm. red velvet, mm -hmm. uh, blueberry. We just did an apple stuffed waffle, which was amazing. Ooh. Is it layered or does it have apples on the inside it's of it? apples inside, like an oh. apple pie, girl. Thank you. Apple pie, yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, won't he do All it? Right, I'm going to let you it. mix that up. Okay, so I'm going to mix, mix it up. A little bit more. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get this one started for us though, because I do have it already mixed. And what brought you to Conyers? Because you're a Baltimore girl like me. I am a Baltimore girl. Um, my husband and I, we just lived in Conyers. I mean, I've always been downtown and going out to the countryside a little bit. I, I love it. Mm -hmm. I love me it. Too. Me and my girls me love too. it. We have more space, you know, more room, but Conyers has been really good to us. Now, when you chose your Restaurant location. It was based on where you lived, or it, was it? It based was. On Can you imagine if I chose a location downtown? Oh my God. Well, I mean, we're working on it, but the traffic. Yeah, oh, with gosh. Coco Brown on the traffic. Oh my God, it was horrible this morning. You have to drop breadcrumbs like Hansel and Gretel. No, Everywhere you go. Seriously, seriously. I got a husband, but I mean, if we have a rich man who can get us a helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> I would enjoy that too. Yes. And yes. you're passionate about inner city girls. Yes. So where does that inspiration come from? Well, you know, I grew up in Baltimore. Yes. Uh, <laughs> yes, I grew up in Baltimore. Um, you know, it, with me having five girls and being a mother, I've always wanted to encourage and motivate young girls. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like it's not enough of it, you know. I have a business, I have a husband, I'm still a mom. Um, and we can do it. I think it's a lot of restraint sometimes on women saying that they can't do certain things and you can have it all. You can have a business and you can still be a wonderful mom and an awesome wife. And how do you and balance a good girlfriend. that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 And how, how do you balance all those? Do we put this inside of here? Yeah, just, just, just a sprinkle. Just, just, just a smidge. sprinkle. That's Not it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Um, balancing it, let's just say prayer. Yeah. <laughs> lots of prayer, mm -hmm. lots of coffee, <laughs> and lots of wine. Oh, yes. Well, yes, I love wine. Yes. I'm, a, I'm a proponent yes. of wine. I bought you some wine. Don't you what? worry. Oh, you did? Say I did. Yes. I bought wine. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, one is here. One is here. One is here. One is here. Banana pudding, chicken, and waffles. Banana pudding. Yeah. Go. Let's go ahead Thank and top you. this off. So I'm gonna top this off with a little bit of whipped cream. Yeah. The more whipped, yes. the better. Yes. That looks yummy. Oh, delicious. Oh, yes. Oh. And what, what is this drizzle made from? Okay, now that's Nana's signature drizzle. Mm -hmm. I can't give you, I can't give you that recipe. Oh, right. can't tell the trying drizzle. to take that back to the restaurant, Trina. I can't give you that recipe. Okay, I won't but steal you. <laughs> anybody got a baggie? Because I'm about to put it away. Right. Which one would we like? I got, I got right you here? that one. Yeah, okay, we're gonna go ahead. Go. Me and Trina finish this one. Okay. I'll put okay. a little bit more drizzle on the top of it. Yeah, go ahead and drizzle it off. Can't steal it. Drizzle it off. Welcome. You got it. Welcome. There you go. I'm gonna put my own look. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go Ooh, ahead and do that. Ooh, so those yeah. vanilla wafers on it. Yeah. Vanilla wafers. Yes. 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 Right. And you can leave out the chicken if you're vegan or vegetarian. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Mm. And I got you guys some, well, you ladies, some mimosas. Mimosas, I love mimosas. No. Those yeah. real mimosas? Yes, those real like, mimosas. Y'all like alcohol? Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. You can't, you can't do, do, it. do it. You can't do it. You can't do it. Well, me well, and Coco can. How do you know I'm here? I don't have my baby. Okay, after we have this bad room, we're going to cook it for about two minutes and 30 seconds. You can do about two minutes and 30 seconds. Of course, you do your chicken. I have my own. Uncle Butcher seasoning. I have okay. my own line of seasonings right now. Good. All right. Family, yeah. So All right. Okay. Well, thank you yes. so much, everybody. If you're in the Atlanta area, be sure to check out Nana's Chicken and Waffles in Conyers, Georgia.